All right, today I'm going to show you how to calibrate your autofocus in your 5D Mark II using the live view mode. First thing you're going to want to do is hang a picture on the wall, something with uh, a lot of text on it, some bolder white text around black, different, uh, different, uh, different sizes, but make sure that uh, they're at the same distance, it's not sticking off the wall. You're going to want to compare what the autofocus system says is in focus versus what you see on the live view. The live view is what's important because ultimately that's what's getting captured on the sensor. So what you're going to do is go into here, your lens, and we're going to calibrate the Sigma 2470 2.8, which is a lens that's notorious for back focusing. And I've already calibrated this lens. We'll just go through the steps on how to do it. <clears throat> so what you're going to do is first of all put your head up, look at your viewfinder, and lock in a center point autofocus. Turn your live view on. Turn your autofocus system off, usually it's on the lens, for Canon it is, and you use this button right here. This will give you a 10x or pixel for pixel zoom. Now, as you do a pixel for pixel zoom, you'll see what your, what your autofocus system says is in focus. And you'll see here, it's probably very rough on the video camera, but you'll see here that this lens has been calibrated and that's perfectly in focus. If you turn it just slightly, the image goes out of focus. So let's say you have something like this. It's a little bit uh, back focused. In order to change this, you'll, what you'll do is you will turn your autofocus back on, which will zoom out of your live view. Turn live view off. Go into your menu. Go into your functions menu. And uh, right here, you have autofocus and drive which was focus or which was FN2 or FN3 autofocus and drive so you have on the screen here autofocus drive autofocus micro adjustment you're gonna adjust by the same amount for all lens or adjust by lens I believe that the 5D Mark II can remember up to 99 lenses I could be incorrect it could just be 10 but uh, it does remember this lens it's one of my main lenses so every time this lens gets put on my camera it adjusts the autofocus by plus 15 that's how off this lens is. Um, but again, it is a good lens, so that's why I continue to use it. Um, so let's remember 15. And uh, so you hit info to make changes to it. Let's remember 15 and let's go to center, which is zero, which is the lens out of the box. And let's recalibrate. Let's look through this one more time. Let's get an autofocus. What the autofocus system says is in, is in focus. Let's. Uh, Go to manual. You have to do, in order to do the 10x zoom, you have to make sure the lens is in manual focus. Turn the live view back on, and we go to the 10x, and as you can see, that is out of focus. Each, you probably can't see in this video, but each word is slightly, each letter slightly blurred. So when I turn it forward focused just a little bit, each word becomes very sharp. So just that little turn equals 15 in a micro focus adjustment. So don't be surprised, you know, 15 is actually a very small number for micro focus adjusting. So let's go back, uh, and you need to do it a couple times, don't just do it once. So you're going to go back, turn autofocus on, relock your autofocus, turn it to manual focus, turn your live view on, zoom in at your 10x or pixel for pixel zoom on the screen, and you'll see that yes, it is still, still blurry. So, and see if that same adjustment sharpens it up and it does so you'll turn your autofocus back on live view off go into your menu mode go into custom function 3 menu adjust by lens hit the info to make the changes and we'll push this up 15 where it was at and uh, rerun the assessment put it on autofocus lock in autofocus Turn the autofocus off, live view, your 10x pixel for pixel zoom, and it is sharp. Every, uh, every, every pixel is sharp on that. So as you can see, this was off by 15. A small amount in micro focus adjustments, but it makes a big difference when you're shooting images and you're getting that tack sharpness, especially at 21 megapixels.